Hey, what is up, everybody? John's back with another video for you guys, and 4th of July just passed this weekend. I hope everybody had a really, really good 4th of July. I know I did. Saw nothing but fireworks all weekend. I was okay with that. Let me know down in the comments how your 4th of July was. And also, it was around this time last year, which we can segue into perfectly. It's been a year since I've been back in PA, so I figured, hey, why not talk about it? Before I dive into how things have been back here in PA the past year, um, I'm going to give you some context for those who are out of the loop or who are new to the channel and don't know my story prior to this video. I moved to California, Los Angeles to be specific, back in July of 2018. And then I lived there for two years and then I moved back. At the time of recording this video, it is July 5th at 10 p.m. I moved back exactly a year ago. I mean, of course, no matter where you live, where you're living at currently or where you're going to live in the future, there's going to be pros and cons no matter where you live. Now, some pros are, you know, since I've been back, it definitely, it's been nice just not having that congestion all the time to worry about, like, literally everywhere I drive, it's just so seamless, like, I don't ever get stuck in traffic, it's rare. Peace and quiet where I'm living right now, I don't live in a city, I'm, I'm the only one making noise right now, like, it's, it's freaking great. I think my nephew's in bed. And, you know, some things since I've been back, now this can, you know, you can do this anywhere, of course. It honestly lasts like eight years of my life. My real physical activity I've been getting was on stage, but the last past year or so, I've been a lot more adamant about getting outside and being more physical and working out and stuff. I've been playing flag football the last year. I'm building connections with people that I wouldn't have necessarily have if I didn't start playing flag football, which is really nice. And it really helps with the mental health a lot too, not just with the body. I won a championship back in, I believe it was November or December with uh, my team, the Sunday School at the time. And we went undefeated that season. It was a really cool, really cool journey. We got this trophy as well. Some of the bad, uh, it's just like how I felt when I first moved to California was I just felt like a fish out of water back in 2018 and before that. California has more people that fit my vibe, you know, more laid back, more chilled, more open-minded. Not to say that people can't be here and the people that are like that here, I really appreciate you. You guys are the true MVPs. I just like the weather, the dry climate more out there in Cali. It's really humid and it rains a lot here. It's just really not my style. The biggest negative was winter this year. Ooh. I went two winters without really seeing much snow. The only time I saw snow in California is when I went up 3,000 feet. Did not like it one bit, and I knew I wouldn't. Never, never really cared for winter. And I missed my friends out in California. Shout out to you guys. You know who you are. But with that said, um, I think the pros of Pennsylvania, it's, 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 it's allowed me to like slow down and focus on Ocean again more so. I would say that is a huge, huge pro. I'm posting a lot of covers. I want to go check that out. I, that would mean the world to me. I really appreciate that. Really growing a really, really, really even stronger bond with a really good friend and former bandmate of Ocean, uh, Dylan Marr. He's been producing a lot of things for me. We've done covers together. We've been working on originals together. He's been producing stuff for Ocean as well. And I have a master track back at the time of recording this video. It is not out. I cannot wait to share that song with you guys. It's called True Intentions. This move has definitely been back to PA. It's, had, it's not a permanent decision by any means. I don't know where I'll end up. If you guys want to find out where I end up, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys can continue to hear my journey. We'll see where I end up. Uh, I'll end up out of the state. I might end up back in LA. I might end up in Southern California. I might not end up anywhere near California. I might end up, you never know, in Europe or something. Anybody that wants to chill in PA, hey, you still got a while, so let's let's definitely make sure to hang out at some point. Yeah, I mean, there's really there's really not too much more to say than that. That's mostly what I've been up to is music and just keeping active, playing football with people and just chilling with people every so often, and it's just been chill, I will say that.